Okay, uh, my thought process was easy because you know, once a model, always a model, and I'll never retire. So when Sleek, you guys, yeah, contacted me and told me that you wanted a fashion um, look wardrobe, I decided that you know what, let me just partner with my own local designers. Uh, so I contacted young designer Otik. Of course, I, it's the first time I'm working with him and um, it goes above and beyond and you see how the looks unfold. Of course, I'm wearing Carlton Brown as we speak. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mr. Carlton Brown, you know, say so he's the man with the suit. Very detailed. And why I chose the suit as a woman, I'm bossing up. And you know, so a woman does it better than a man. Mm -hmm. oh, I'm just saying. We're bossing up now and um, it's not male dominant anymore. It's split. Just like that, like when you are conceived, baby, making a child, it's equal. Yeah, that's how, we, that's how I'm feeling, equal right now. Mm -hmm. So that's what we wear. That's why I, I chose the suit to, to, to show dominance and show empowerment as woman, because that's what we're about, female empowerment. Yeah. Have killer have the woman then. I'm just saying. Disclaimer. Got that sauce in it. When I'm doing business, it all depends on what. I'm always event appropriate, so it all depends on what I'm doing. Uh, office attire, if, if it, well, if I'm doing business, I, a business meeting, I dress accordingly. Can be a suit. Does it have to be a pantsuit? This is a male suit I'm in, actually. <laughs> yeah, and it's unisex, male and female. But um, I tend to look the parts because that will definitely tell if you're serious. That will definitely show whomever you're doing business with. If this woman is serious or she's a joker. So how you dress actually dictates if you win or if you take over or you could get that position. How you dress dictates a lot. Yeah. Okay, my number one tip for a business meeting for a lady is make sure that you wear comfortable shoes, comfortable heels, and I prefer pumps, no peep toes and uh, um, something comfortable so your foot don't tumble and wobble out of them. Yeah, that's just my number one. Okay. I'm wearing Bella's body. Um, of course, um, when you want to feel relaxed in the gym and can work out and, you know, have on the right gear, then you go to Bella's Body. And um, my sneakers is Puma by Western Sports. Of course, yes. So this is it. And my Palati is also, is Palati? Palati bar. And my, and my Palati bar is also from Bella Body. I'm gonna demonstrate how, it's, how it works. Not 100% now, just tip on this. Tip on if you know, and you can get in those shoulders. Get in those shoulders. I want to get in one more. Get in those shoulders. Yes. <laughs> Yeah, 
definitely angelic. As an angel, you have to represent, you know, it's ordained. So it's all white, baby. With a tops of gold, a tops of black, a tops of color, but maintaining my aesthetic white. This award look, ah, uh, wow. I just contacted Otik because I saw that his aesthetic kind of suit what I know, that what I was going for is a young designer, but I'm telling you, his styling is grown because this is grown and sexy. So, I mean, he nailed it in six hours. This is commendable. This is just way over the top. You understand? And I love it. It fit me like a glove. He didn't do a measurement, anything at all. He just did it because I have that mannequin body. So he just did it from the mannequin right on the body. I commend you. From makeup, Monique Montu Cute. She's my go to makeup artist, in house makeup artist. And she knows what suits best and she knows what suits what look, which look. And um, she, she pulled it off. All natural glam. Yeah. I would say just ask Otik how he did it. This is fashion, baby. Fashion works as long as it's fashionable, fashion works. So anything goes. For a brunch, how do you keep your look clean for a brunch? Ah, as the name says, um, I'm an angel, so I'm always clean. I just sit carefully in my dress, eat carefully, and just mingle and lime carefully, and I'll stay clean. My favorite part about this look, um, it just looks like a doll. Like, it just looks like a goddess, fairy tale, almost like surreal. And um, it ties in well with earth because the flower, everything just brings life and joy to me. When I saw this look, I liked, I smiled. I'm like, this is over the top brunch. But for me, I'm always over the top and fashion is very over the top. So I commend Atik again for creating something like this. Um, not expected, but expect anything from it. Three things I have to have in my bag when I go out to eat. Oh, of course, my lip gloss. My lip gloss is popping. Or, um, wow. All right, three things I have to have in my bag when I go out to eat. I have to have my Montu Cute lip gloss. Mm -hmm. Keeps my lip juicy and glossy. Uh, mm, I have to have my Get Vex Money. Mm -hmm. uh, my third thing is when I go out to eat, uh, apart from looking fabulous, uh, just a little. I'm compact. Oh no, I have to have my floss. I have to have my floss. Because you know, after you finish eat, there you go. Mm -hmm. Yeah, floss in. 